Hi guys, what I'd like to talk about today is using wide angle lenses on your camera or indeed on your, your smartphone because most of them have got wide angle lenses on them. What's really, really important if you're using a wide angle lens is to make sure that if you're shooting scenery that your foreground is, is strong. Uh, because what happens is that if you put a wide angle lens on it tends to push the horizon the subject away from the the camera so you've got to make sure that your foreground is strong enough to hold that let's take this picture of some grasses for example up in the Swartberg mountains without that grass the picture would be nothing those mountains have been pushed back it's less dramatic but with the grass there, that holds the viewer's attention in the foreground and stops it moving out the bottom of the picture. The same goes for this rocky outcrop at Mashatu Game Reserve in Botswana. Without that grass and sand in the foreground, the picture just doesn't hang together and that really dramatic outcrop of sandstone would not be nearly as impressive as it is with that strong foreground. I've taken that grass out in Photoshop, not very well I might add, but have a look here and see what it looks like without that grass. And it's not nearly as dramatic as with that strong foreground interest. The same applies to this photograph of this rock on the whale coast here in South Africa. If we take the rock away, the picture becomes nothing. A pebbled beach with a very distant horizon but that rock holds the viewer's attention and turns the picture into something worth looking at. Guys, do make sure that you're following us. Uh, there will be more of these uh, videos that we're putting up, little short tips on photography, on Lightroom perhaps, on editing, on the use of lenses, on photographic equipment, and all that sort of stuff. Thanks for joining us on this one, and we'll catch you on the next one. Cheers.